Now I'm going to show you how to do wrist curls. I like to use a bench here because what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my upper legs to help support my arms while I'm doing the curl. So you're going to grab a lighter weight. Wrist curls don't need heavy dumbbells, don't need a lot of weight. The muscles in your wrists are small and they're delicate and we don't want to pull any muscles or tendons or ligaments. So start off lighter weights and you can work your way up to heavier weights. What I'm doing is I'm placing my lower arms right on top of my thighs here. My palms are facing up. I've got my wrist right to the edge of my knees. We're going to start our wrist curl now. What we're going to do is we're just going to let those hands drop down. Okay? What we're going to do now is we're squeezing up. This is working our forearms. Bringing that weight down, we're going to curl up and we're going to squeeze our forearms up and down just like that. No movement other than my wrists right now. Up and squeeze and back down. Where you're going to feel this exercise in the forearm. It's going to start burning right here, completely normal. I like a little bit higher reps on this exercise. So anywhere 10 to 15 is perfect. Go until you can't go no more. You're going to feel a burn on this one. Okay? Wrist curls. That's all there is to it.